The initiative is referred to as the Performance-Based Finance Mechanism and is a major part of St. Lucia's Health System Strengthening Project. Performance-Based Finance Coordinator of the St. Lucia Health System Strengthening Project, Niam Jobatis, explains, this system provides incentives or benefits to both the providers and receivers of healthcare. First of all, we want to reduce mortality from communicable diseases. In our case, we are focusing on diabetes and hypertension. So this would be the, the overall goal, to reduce uh, mortality and also, if you want, consequences of diabetes, diabetes and hypertension. Jabatis notes the aim of the initiative is to improve healthcare in St. Lucia, to produce positive outcomes to patients, and to encourage people to utilize the health services. So there are two sets of people receiving incentives. One would be the, the, let's look at the most important persons, the clients. So the clients would receive free, for now, for now they would receive free laboratory testing. Um, the persons who provide the service, what they will do, they will be receiving additional funds uh, which they could use under agreed um, um, conditions um, based on their performance. So if, for example, we set a target and then they have achieved the target or have surpassed the target, we're going to reward them or provide them incentives so that they can use that service to enhance the services, maybe to train their staff or to do other things. Performance-based finance programs are prevalent in many low- and middle-income countries, but the system will be new to St. Lucia. Reporting from the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Health and Wellness, I am Fennel Neptune.